Alright, hey there everybody, Kirby1917 here. Welcome back for more Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy Kong's Quest. Today we'll be going into Krimland, that's right. Captain K. Rool has his own amusement park on his island. I, I don't know why, but he does. Let's go ahead and go into Target Terror. Oh yeah, look at that. I always love this background, it's very, very detailed. Of course, now we get to ride on a roller coaster. Uh, yeah, I believe this roller coaster has a. Uh, yeah, you, you simply just jump without the. Uh, yeah, you simply just jump in the air without moving the cart itself. You know, just like in real life, because you know if, if you jump while on a roller coaster, your force will carry you with the roller coaster. It's it's simple physics, really. I mean. There's nothing really to question about it. Go ahead and try it in real life. It works every time. I do it all the time. You know, don't hit the X's. Basically, the the thing that is, uh... Ooh, uh, I missed it. Oh well. Uh, basically the thing about this level is that, uh... You gotta hit the green boxes. Oh, what am I saying boxes for? <laughs> you gotta hit the green barrels to open up the gates. And avoid hitting the X's to avoid closing them. Very simple concept. It's not too hard with this first level. I also like how the roller coaster simply uh, goes up hills when it doesn't have any momentum to it whatsoever. Oh, I think I could go down there for a secret. Oh well. <laughs> I like how they duck underneath the uh, the gates, even though they're not going to get hit. Oh boy, that was close. That ah, can be a little tricky one to hit right there. Oh, I hate that jump right there. Haha! -ha. Skills! And of course, you can see that there's no trouble with that whatsoever. Let's see, I believe we can get up here. Uh, I want that one up balloon. Or, you know, when I say one up balloon, I obviously mean bananas. Because that, that, that's obviously what I want. <laughs> okay. Now we get to go to Bramble Scramble. Another form of Bramble Blast. This time I think it's more platforming instead of, uh... Barrel Blasting. We are up in the sky. Oh, what's over here? Uh, just the, uh... Letters. Alright, there we go. Uh... Jump, Diddy! There you go, there you go, Diddy. Alright. Oh, we got the freaking boomerang hook guys. It's pretty funny how both of their hands are, uh, are hooks. I'll try to get that inv invulnerability, uh, invincibility bo uh, barrel. I like how it doesn't drown out the music in the background. Oh, bonus barrel. Uh, collect the stars, of course. Why not? We've got squawks here. You know, this time we're not on squawk saft. We are in squawks, uh, forest of thorns. Alright, don't want to hit the, the vines, because then they will boot you out of the bonus game. That wouldn't be very fun. Ah, uh, get this guy here. Oh man, I missed this guy. Come on. Oh, no problem whatsoever. Alright. I don't know why I couldn't let us keep Squawks, because we're going to need him in a few seconds. Yeah, see, here he is, like right here. They, they drop him by you. You know, Squawks in the box. It it almost rhymes. Actually, it does rhyme. <laughs> what, am, what am I saying? So now, yeah, now we basically have... Uh, a squawk segment. Oh, I don't want to go in there. Oh boy, red ones. The invincible bees of tomorrow, today. I believe there's a guy. Yeah, yeah, he's right here. You ain't kidding me this time. <laughs> but that guy will. Yeah, uh, when you're with squawks, it's weird because even though he's holding up the Kongs. You can touch the ground, you can touch the thorn 
with uh, the Kong, so you'll be fine. But if you if you touch the uh, come on, let me hit him. There we go. Just wait. Uh, there we go. But if you hit the thorns with squawks, then it will count as a hit, and you'll lose a monkey. And I've never really got that. I think it should be the opposite. I think you should be able to fly along the ceiling. Oh boy. <laughs> I'll be back. Oh, well, get, I just had to get to listen to more great music. Okay, I think we're back where we, well, I got killed last time, I think. Yeah, it was this guy right here. Oh, jerk, man. Throwing your hooks around all over the place like you own the place. You don't own this place. Squawk zones it. Just for that, we're gonna go get two uh, banana tokens, banana medals. Who cares? <laughs> if you fly too high with squawks over here, then the min the bananas will get stuck. That's what I found funny. All right, go ahead and get Dixie back, so we have an extra hit. I know you're gonna pretty much want to use Diddy in this part, because it's all about climbing. Uh, wait for this cannonball to go. Yeah, there we go. I like how they timed this. They timed it pretty well, I think. Oh, is there anything down here? <laughs> well, you could have got uh, the spider guy here. If you wanted to, I guess. And here's another squawks. You know, you can't have squawks once in this level. Oh no, we have to have squawks twice. In fact, I think Squawk appears more in this level than he does in uh, Squawk Saft. That's pretty funny. I think. I don't know, do you think it's funny? I find it's funny. I'm gonna wait for the B Carousel to go around. You know, B Carousel. Not really fun times for no one over there. I wouldn't want to ride in a B Carousel. Sounds dangerous. Ah, kill the yellow bees, avoid. Ah, what the heck, just avoid them all. I only, I only really kill the ones that get in my way. Just going out and killing all of them would just be a waste of time. I got another beat carousel that forces you to go in this direction. I don't know why you would go. Oh, okay, that's why. I was like, why would you go right? But the reason is because if you went right, it would uh, <laughs> be faster. There you have these ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, guys. Just, just fly us past them. Sit them up in the back if you want to. Even though they're weird. Whatever. They should die for being different. Aww. Hey, give me my banana buns. As Diddy plays us off with the boombox. There we go. And we have funky flights over here if you want it, you know? And we have a rickety race. Oh boy. This is a cool level, whereas, uh, you're actually going, you're actually somewhat racing other people. It's not really a race, because, you know, it's 2D, whatever. But your goal is to get ahead of them. And, uh, the farther you go, the more ahead you get, the more cooler stuff you get. So let's see how far I can get. Bow, bow. Kill this guy real fast. Uh, I believe if you hold right, then uh, you go faster, and if you hold left, you go slower. Uh, basically, what you want to do for this one is, I find, yeah, just pass that guy. You don't need to kill him. <laughs> what I find you need to do is constantly hold right. Hold right from the very beginning. If you do that, then you'll be able to... Uh, Okay, slow down when you get up to this guy, because he'll be a problem. Oh, boy, I don't think I'll do it now. Oh, man. Come on. Let me pass you. Well, that sucks. Oh, there we go. At least I got him fourth, right? <laughs> Yeah, that's all I got. <laughs> oh no, never mind, I could pass this guy if I wanted to. 
All right, third place. I'll, I'll take third place. That's good. I think the end is, yeah, third place. Uh, obviously, if you get first, then uh, you'll be able to get a DK token. Whoa, hold on, what? Oh, I see. Yeah, I give me a single banana. <laughs> yeah, as you get first place, you can get a DK token. I've done it before. It's it's alright. I thought I was doing what I was supposed to. I don't know what happened there. I don't know why I kept bumping into that guy. I guess I was a little bit too hasty. And yeah, that, that's it for Kremlin. I mean, that's it. You just get uh, two roller coaster levels and the storm and the Sick of Symphony song. So, uh, I mean, it's not too bad. I wish I would have done more with Kremlin because that was like one of my favorite places. But uh, let's go ahead and go into Mud Hole Mars. Another swamp. Oh boy. Diddy, you need to stop ducking. Like, I know you're scared and stuff, but you, you need to stop it. Because you kind of scare me here. Oh, here we are introduced to the Cat of Nine Tails, I believe its name is. Oh boy. Oh well, it's not that bad. All it really does is, uh. If it catches you, it spins you around and throws you in a direction. But you can kind of control where you land by uh, holding either left or right. And here we have a chest within a chest within a chest that just has some bananas in it. So it wasn't really worth it. But if you want to kill them, I mean, I didn't know you could kill these guys up until like a few months ago, honestly. Like, I thought the only way was just to run away from them. But apparently if you wait for them to stop spinning, and for them to get dizzy, then they will, uh... What's up here? That was weird. Whatever. And if you wait for them to stop spinning and get dizzy, then you can attack them. I don't know why it jumps into that. Alright. These crows are annoying, man. I wonder, no, wait, I might say they're not crows. God dang it, first boss, making me question what these guys are. I guess you can use this guy to get in that bonus uh, barrel if you want. Come on. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> you need to jump on those guys to get that bonus barrel. They're pretty mean here. Oh boy, alright, there we go. Oh, is there anything up here? Just, just a bunch of bananas? I believe you can ki Oh boy, no. I was gonna say you could probably kill these guys from a distance by throwing, uh... By throwing, like, either Diddy or Dixie at them. But I'm not exactly sure. I don't think I've done it before. Yeah, come on. Fly at me. And we'll go ahead and miss. We have these swamp alligators, crocodiles, whatever. Oh, I missed. Fine. There we go. Not too hard at all. The nine-tailed demon cat. Oh, what is he shooting at me? Just barrels? Alright. I heard the sound. I'm like, what is he shooting? Here, take a cannonball. Shoot some rail ammunition for chains. Don't be shooting out barrels. How do you reload that? How do you shoot out barrels from a gun? Destroy them all with a cannonball. There we go. Let's get this guy. And kill this. And there you go. Whoa. I was trying to roll off the edge and jump, but Diddy kind of picked up the cannonball. I was like, dude, don't do that. It's not cool. I was gonna fall. Luckily, I foresaw it. I was worried he might fall back into the uh, swamp. 